I'm Tom Johnson, Thomas Johnson, Antique Furniture Restoration in Gorm, Maine. This is a Lion and Healy pedal harp. It's not an antique, but it's in good shape, except it did take a fall and suffer some uh, cosmetic damage, but bad cosmetic damage right here. I've got to fill this area in, smooth it out, and repaint this area black. Okay, so the first step would be to tape off the heart, but actually before I do that, I'm going to put some uh, epoxy stick in this damaged area. It could be drying while I tape off the rest of it. All right, so now I'll start sanding with 100 grit. See, this feels nice and smooth. It even feels level. But that little black line around the, the edge there tells me I'm not level. In fact, I'm not really level until it's not black, but white wood like that. All right, I've sanded to 150, and now I'm going to spray it with a black satin aerosol. Over the course of the next, uh, say, four hours, I'll spray two more coats on it. And then tomorrow I'll sand it again. All right, as I said, I sprayed a few more coats on it. I've let it dry overnight. It's amazing because it looks, looks really good. You know, my main concern was just, you know, spraying this with an aerosol. How is it going to blend this in? And it is a satin aerosol. It looks great. But I can feel it, and it's not completely smooth. I need to sand it with some 500. I think I can get rid of this tape, sand this area, and spray spray it maybe just one more time. And I do have a little, few little faint sand throughs right there, which is a good thing because that means those were high spots. This coat uh, dries as well as the last coat did. Okay, I've let this dry actually for a couple days now. The black aerosol worked really well. The uh, visually, the sheen and everything is perfect. I can still feel a little bit of uh, fuzziness around the edges, but I have some black uh, medium grade compound here. I'm gonna, so I'm going to remove all my tape and then compound this a little bit. See if I can. Uh, finish it up. I'm 
now the compound's starting to dry. Now that I've compounded it, now I can see I've got two little drips right there. I gotta sand them out. So I'm gonna take a little uh, 1200 uh, and water, see if I can sand those out. They might be gone, but you never really know until you polish it again. Yeah, that, uh, that looks pretty good. The, uh, we'll let it dry for a while, and while that's going on, I'll uh, take the cover off, blow this off, and polish it with some furniture polish. All right. There you go, a beautiful pedal harp. It's fallen over, the end of it was really badly damaged, but uh, you know, I looked out, the, my can of aerosol satin lacquer really, really matched up with the sheen. It looks really good. I should say, it looks pretty good. <laughs>